Say hi, boys. Hi. Say hi, Porter. Porter, no, no, put that down. So, um, good morning, everyone. We are outside playing. I kind of wanted to show you, give you an update on the status of the house. Now that I have um, told you guys that we found a house and we are um, closing on it soon and going to put our current house up on the market. So I wanted to just give you like an update on how things are going. Okay, sorry, um, Anthony came in the room. He brought me some coffee because we were up so, so late last night. So anyway, like I was saying, um, I wanted to give you an update and kind of show you what the house is looking like. We close on our new house one week from today and we put our current house on the market two weeks from today. So kind of a crazy time right now, um, but I'll show you this is what the garage is looking like. So while Anthony's job has been to um, fix things around the house, primarily the bathroom flooring, that's what all this is. He's been cutting tiles with his tile saw. I, I honestly couldn't even tell you all the things that he's doing, but he's been doing a lot. There's some hardy backer board we've been using. He and his dad are gonna do shelves this weekend and uh, walls. My job has been to pack um, up items and declutter the house so it looks as big as possible. So here's all of that. And all these suitcases are um, winter clothes of Anthony and I's. Um, all this stuff is mostly like baby newborn stuff that we just don't need right now, but don't want to let go of because we're going to have more kids in the future. Um, we've got like an ice cream machine here, like the bouncer. Um, we've got just a box of things um, like books from our bookshelf and stuff. Um, this table, my brother is going to take it. Um, we're trying to sell some things on Facebook. I don't know if I've gotten no hits, so I'm not sure that it's really going to happen. But we're trying to get rid of like this um, mini bookshelf. I went through the kids' playroom and boxed up or like bagged up a bunch of toys that we're just going to get rid of that the boys just don't really care for. Um, that's a trash bag I need to throw out. So the garage is looking quite a mess. Anthony said he was going to try and um, clean it up today because his dad is coming tomorrow um, and they're going to work so hard the next two days and we are so thankful for his help. Um, Anthony's going to mow today. We'll probably mow today and then we'll mow one more time um, before we put, like do showings for the house so that the yard looks nice. Um, and then I'll show you inside, once we go inside, Porter's just kind of playing around in here, although I probably shouldn't have been playing here. Your cup, should we go inside? Yeah. Okay, um, we'll go inside and I'll show you, but there's just like boxes everywhere. My mom is gonna be here any minute and she's gonna help me pack and we're gonna do some cleaning. Um, I think I mentioned it in the last video, but we do have a cleaning company coming to clean the house while we're out of town. So it's gonna be making the house look as nice as possible. Um, oh, we're gonna go to the backyard now. Just the house is a mess. Um, I should have vlogged last night, but we were so tired. Um, I helped Anthony with the tiling of the bathroom floor and we started, Anthony said he started at 6.30. We had an event that we went to for my work um, so I didn't get back until like 8.30 and then I started helping Anthony and we worked, well, I went to bed at 3.30 in the morning because I just couldn't stay up anymore and I had to get up in four hours with the kids. Um, and Anthony, I talked to him this morning, you want me to turn it on? Yeah. Porter wants to play with the hose. Anthony told me that he stayed up until 5.15 a.m. in the morning. He said he saw the sunrise come up, so... Yeah, we're um, pretty exhausted today. That is definitely the latest that we have ever stayed up. Um, Anthony has been pulling like 2 a.m. shifts lately and I've been staying up like, I usually step to like 1 or 1.30 and then I just can't do it anymore. But last night we were just really trying to grind out um, the sticky stuff to like put the tiles down and I, you know, I'm not very good at telling you what's really going on, but we had to put the sticky stuff down to make the tile stay in place. And we had to do it then because we have to wait 72 hours for it to harden. And we're, we just don't have time. So we had to stay up and get it all done last night. And so it was really, really tiring. And so now we can't touch the bathroom yeah. until Sunday, yeah. I think. Today's Friday. Oh, sorry, Porter. I just sprayed Porter. Woohoo! So um, 
We're gonna be working on other things today. Like I said, I think Anthony's gonna mow. And um, we'll probably maybe do some power washing and just like odds and ends around the house. So um, hopefully we don't stay up as late tonight. I don't think Anthony and I would be make it um, much later than midnight. So um, hopefully we survive today. Um, we both have had coffee. I think Anthony's had several cups. I usually just do one. We'll see. <laughs> um, but yeah, when we go inside, I'll show you guys how the house is looking. Um, it's looking a mess right now, but it has to get worse before it gets better, right? That's what they always say. So I'll show you guys, but um, it is sure chaotic. Like this time in our lives, so chaotic right now. Um, I'm sure you can relate if you've ever like bought a house and then had to sell your current house. This is the first time we've had to sell a house because um, this is our first house we ever bought. So this is like kind of new territory for us. So um, we're just trying to get it all right. So anyway, Again. hope you guys are enjoying your June. I can't believe it's almost July. Um, I really feel like this month has just flown by. And um, I was telling Anthony, it just feels so weird today is Friday, like I said, and it feels so weird to be going into the weekend and not scheduling house showings to go look at houses because that's been our life since January and it's June. So like for six months, half a year, we every weekend we've been going to see houses. And so now it's just like that's done and it's so nice, but it just feels like, I feel like I'm forgetting something. Like, you know, when you graduate high school or college and um, you're like, oh my gosh, I feel like I should be doing homework, but I don't have to anymore because I'm not in school anymore. That's what it feels like. It feels like we should be going and looking at houses, even though we have a house. So. Anyway, I'm rambling, I'm exhausted. I'll show you a cute, cute video of Porter. Ready? This is Porter's favorite thing. He likes to fill up cups with water. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, did I get your hand? It's okay. He likes to fill up cups with water and then dump them. Go put it in the water table. No. Or on the ground, is that what you're doing? Okay, now I'll get my coffee. Porter's a pretty simple guy. You say hi. Hi. Hmm. You guys playing? Whoa, you're so high up, Gray. And look at you, Porter. Are you gonna get down? Good morning, you guys. It is actually the next day. Um, I like filmed that one or two clips and then uh, we've just been so busy with the house. I haven't been able to pick up my camera, um, but we are here at our neighborhood park for probably one of the last, if not the last time we will come to this park. I have a feeling we'll probably come one or two more times because I think we got a little bit longer in this house, but it's not going to be too many more times. And we really haven't got the opportunity to come out this way because we've been so busy working on the house. But um, yeah, we're enjoying this one last time. Thankfully, our new house, it's actually surrounded by three different parks. And I haven't seen all three of them, but the ones, I think I've seen two of them so far and they've looked awesome. One of them has like a pond where you could go fishing and stuff and just looks like really fun play equipment for the boys and they're walking distance from our house. So we'll have to find our new paths, our new trails to walk around the neighborhood. Um, but I'm so excited for that. It actually is cool today. The past couple days have been so humid and nasty and sweaty, but today actually feels really, really good. Um, today is Monday. So today starts like our, excuse my language, hell week. <laughs> <laughs> we have to get everything ready and done with the house by Friday because that's when we leave. We leave Friday night to um, go on vacation to Georgia and we close on our house on Friday as well. So we need to get, it's crunch time. We need to get everything done. We need to stage all the rooms, clean. Um, thankfully we are having a cleaning company come, like I said. Um, Anthony and I are finishing up the bathroom. We finished the floors except for like grout and caulk, I think. Um, and then we're working on the walls right now. We're stripping the walls of the wallpaper and then we got to paint it. I think if they said he had to mud one of the walls or something, but trying to get it all done. I'm stressed. My mom's going to come over today and help me like 
clean I think and um, organize rooms a little bit it's just hard to like stage rooms because I have two kids that just like totally make a mess of all the rooms so I don't know how we're gonna accomplish this but we need to do something because we have like four days five days including today but I don't know how much like we're gonna be able to do on Friday because we have the closing Anthony has work I think he's gonna take a half day and then we go to Georgia like we're gonna go late at night but I don't know I'm just really nervous so send us good thoughts that we can get everything done in time